Deepika and welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel, welcome. I am actually here in Sugarland, Texas which is where I grew up at my parents brand new home and a lot of you guys have been asking me to do a tour of their house so let's just get right to it. Come on in. I am very happy for you. This is my mom's dream home. We just moved in, what, less than six months ago? Less than six months ago, and um, I'm re we stayed in Sugarland. We went from Sugarland to Sugarland, um, and I feel like we have to have her help while we go through the whole place. So let's get started from with the downstairs. Yeah. Okay. Let's start. So we're here in this is our living room. Welcome to the living room, people. <laughs> so to me, my favorite part about the living room is this right here, and this is something that if you see my New York City apartment tour, you have seen and it was actually inspired by what my mom created in this living room, which is, these saris are actually my grandmother's. And so that's something which no, I, I, mean, I know I messed it up, but I didn't know that. So you guys, in my New York City apartment tour, I have my grandmother's sari hung up above my couch in my apartment. And that was inspired by the fact that my mom has her grandma's saris hung up above her couch. As you can see, there's the formal dining room over there. Nothing really to share there. She might disagree, but I don't think it's that special. <laughs> I'm just kidding, it is special, Mom. It's beautiful. Um, and then, of course, we have all of these beautiful statues of things from, you know, Hinduism and the Hindu gods and things that my mom got painted. Somebody painted that, right, Mom? I did. Oh, she did. I made that. It's a little messy, but in my mother's defense, it's because of me. Before you enter into this room, I moved in a month ago and I kind of trashed it. So I basically turned this into my personal little studio and I want to show you guys it because I'm very proud of making things work and how I've been filming my videos for the past month. All right, come in. So basically, I took over one of the guest bedrooms and created a kind of filming station. And you know what? I'm kind of actually very proud of the fact that I don't have all my products here. I don't have like a system. But to be quite honest, it's been more helpful filming videos here than in New York because I have space a luxury in Texas that you don't really have in New York City. We're gonna show you the other side of the downstairs, going right back through the front. Um, there are bedrooms over there, it's not that interesting, so we're just gonna skip over it. Okay, this is the living room. Mom, anything you wanna share about the living room? What, what attracted you to this living room? Well, I like my living room because it is close to my kitchen. I can see everything here. I can see my background, my backyard. You know what? I like the upstairs, so I love this my family room. I like the couch. It's so comfy and nice. It's very. We have a lot of people over. My parents have more parties than I do, and there's always people in this house. So this living room is very accommodating to all of their guests, which I think is really cool. We always have my parents. Um, friends and family over all the time. I really like the high ceilings. It's something I appreciate living in New York City. Don't really get a lot of that, so I found that. It's really interesting because this house is probably like double the size of my parents' old house that I grew up in for like the past 20, 24 years of my life, but it still has a really homey feel to it. Okay, you love your kitchen, so talk about your kitchen. You have so many cupboards here, so I can put all my you know, Indian mashalas here. <laughs> all Indian mashalas here. LOL. Then, yes. But then I have all my, you know, <laughs> all these chinas and lemons. You know what I like about the kitchen? <laughs> all of the wine glasses and all of the whiskey glasses. I was very impressed with my mother yes, for doing this. All these. I live off of like three in my New York apartment. So there's, when I, there's just so much of everything in this state. Um, and then, to be quite honest, my bedroom's upstairs, but I... Well, should we show them? My, no, not really. What is it? There's another bedroom down here, which I have fully taken over. It's a hot mess because all my clothes are there. And it's not supposed to be my bedroom, but when I come in, it becomes a tornado. tornado. Yeah, she used two downstairs guest bedrooms. One for studio, one for her sleeping area. It's here. fine, whatever. She really, her bedroom is upstairs. Yeah, yeah. Let's, oh, let's take them upstairs. Uh -huh. Actually, before we go upstairs, I want to show you guys something because it's very special to me, and I know it's very special to my mother. Oh, well, you just shut the thing oh, that was supposed to put on. I mean, I'm just kidding. She was like just in here, but we have a prayer room, which is something that was really important for us to have. Just a cute little closet that could have, you know, I think it was built to potentially be a wine room. God. That's not what it was meant to be for. I know, but I made this as God room. So it's so peaceful for me every day morning from my master bedroom, I can just come here 
uh, before I go do anything, I just sit there and pray my God. And all my, all my gods are there if you see all the statues and everything. I have my shoes on. I can't be doing that in front of here. I'm going to give you a quick peek into my parents' bathroom because I'm very proud of my mother's makeup collection, courtesy of her daughter, just saying. So, first of all, it's very nice coming home and having a bathtub because I don't even have a tub in my New York apartment. And I've been sitting in here. This thing wouldn't be used if I didn't come home. But I've now sat in here, watched Scandal three times already in the past month that I've been home. It's been so good. I love it. It's relaxing. And then I gave my mom one of my glam boxes and she's been putting it into such good use, you guys. Like She has her eyeliner section, her um, powders, and then all of her, like, Oh my god, look at it. Olay, olay, olay. I told you guys, this has been an OG thing in my family. Olay everywhere. So, very proud of all of her collection here. I'm telling you, I get it from my mama. All right, now let's go upstairs. So, when I say that I was not a part of anything when it comes to picking out this house, it'll be the most evident when you see my room because it's the smallest, darkest room in the house. My sister got the biggest one upstairs. There's a beautiful guest bedroom over there and there's a theater room and then there's my room. Let me take you guys to it right Welcome to the Deepika Shrine, basically. Um, <laughs> awards for me back in the day. Nobody believed it. I was really, I'm still good at basketball. You wanna play me in a horse, I'm going to win. I'm, I still got a shot on me. I might not be good at the dribbling and stuff, but I got a shot on me, I'm telling you. There's more, so these are actually really special and I think it's really great that my mom put it here because I made this for my Amama, which is my mom's mom, um, right before she passed away for her birthday and I think it's really sweet that my mom put it here. Um, and then I made this for my mom for Mother's Day and she put that here, which is really sweet. And then there's this picture of me looking like a creature, which is what I look like as a child apparently. These are my Birchbox kicks. I got them. This is my first job when I lived, worked in New York City. I basically just don't have room in my apartment in New York, you guys. So like I bring everything here and because I didn't want to get rid of this and here they are. All right, well, these are my senior pictures from, I think her name is Christine Meeker in Sugarland, and I still love them. Like. I now take a lot of photos, which is really obnoxious, but it is a part of the job. And I still think these are some of my favorite ones. Like, I don't regret the bangs. I don't regret the top. That was an express top. I'm, I'm like about it. And I'm like, I don't know. These are really well taken. Now this one, on the other hand, <laughs> this is a glamour shot where I thought I looked so fire. Like, look at those bunny teeth. Do those look fire to you? I thought I was so fly. But that's my room. A shrine of me, hope you enjoyed it. Darkest room in the home. I'm not bitter or anything. Just... Okay guys, I hope you liked my Sugarland home tour. Thank you so much for joining me as I took you along at all. And of course, thank you for watching my channel as always. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already done so. And I will see you next time, it's dinner time. Bye guys.